Hey guys, I, I got a bit of a talking video for you today, but I promise it's not going to be as boring as past talking videos. I actually have a lot to talk about today. So, Kaylee and I have been getting ready to move out uh, for the past couple weeks. We've been packing up stuff and getting it put into the garage, getting ready to go. And we've been like super productive today because today is my Sunday on my weekend and instead of sitting around doing nothing, the nice weather outside, which you really can't tell, but uh, has kind of motivated us to get moving and, and you know, start preparing for that moving process. So um, I'm getting really excited because at the end of the month we close on the house and we start moving in in June. But yeah, that's what I wanted to talk to you guys about. I wanted to give you an insight on what, uh, what to expect with the house improvements because we're actually going to have a lot to film when we start doing that. I think what we're going to do is instead of moving in right away, we're going to kind of move some small stuff in and we're going to do like all the paint work that we want to do because right now the countertops are kind of ugly. I, I don't really know what they look like exactly. I haven't really paid full <laughs> full attention, but we actually have this, this um, plan to kind of make them look more like, um, what, granite? countertops because there's like a painting there's a way you can paint them and make them look like it so do that in a video we're also going to do kind of a pan around and do like a before and after sort of thing of us like painting the rooms and and uh moving our furniture in and whatnot the backyard is probably one of the bigger projects that i'm going to start off doing the backyard actually has a lot of rock in it right now and we want grass in our backyard so for the first i don't know month or so I'm um, going to try to get as much done as quickly and as efficiently as possible. We're going to move that rock out and start preparing to plant some grass. So we'll get ready for that. And we're also going to build a fire pit because there's already kind of like, um, what do you call it? Planters? There's, there's like planters that we could dig out and make them into like a fire pit. So we want a fire pit. <laughs> and the back patio, well, we're wanting to put like a, um, what? Pergola. I almost said pagoda. That wasn't gonna be. That was. <laughs> that wasn't gonna be the right thing. I'm gonna put a pergola up so that we have a nice, um, like, cover for our back patio, and we can have like barbecues and whatnot with friends. So, so I think that pretty much covers the projects that we're we're gonna be able to do like right off the bat. There's some bigger projects that we're gonna do later on. Like, uh, we have to paint the outside of the house because the house is due for a paint job according to the inspector, and we have to replace the roof too which really isn't that big of a deal right now. It's still in good enough condition we'll be able to live there for a while, but it's something we gotta take care of eventually. I think another re another thing that we wanna do is later on we wanna get a better fridge and a better oven because they're kind of outdated right now. <laughs> and uh, I mean, ideally though, we'd like to get a gas stove, but unfortunately there's no gas line, so we're just gonna get like a nice flat top stove and one of those um, probably dual dual door fridge with the water and the ice on one side. Kind of giving you an insight on the goals that we have for our house. And Kaylee lately has been adding some stuff to a goal board. Um, I'll actually plug her YouTube channel for that right there. And she's actually a pure on consultant so she's trying to expand her business. And of course I had to add my own goal right there so things to accomplish hopefully so as you've seen before our mountain of stuff and Kaylee <laughs> um, definitely excited to get this all cleaned out and get into our house because we've actually been out of um, our own place for about nine months now so I'm kind of thinking that after we move we're gonna completely forget about some of the stuff that we had <laughs> but we figure you know we've we've gone like nine months without this stuff so I think we're gonna put on a big sale when we when we move because obviously if we haven't really missed our stuff in nine months we don't really need it that bad and that way we can kind of save room for our house or, or save room in our house and maybe start getting some nicer stuff to replace the stuff that we have. Like you guys saw, we got a new dresser and we're, we're trying to improve our lives, you know, better 
every every day, every month, whatever. So, life goals. Oh, and on top of all the exciting house stuff that's going on, I also wanted to express that I am really thrilled with. Uh, well, actually, I should I should say grateful. I'm grateful that I was able to find a better and newer job that actually pays me better because I looked at my pay stub today and already I'm making more than than I was ever getting on like overtime at my last job so it's already just like life is getting better and I'm I I can't express how excited I am about how things are going and I, I don't think I could do it without my lovely wife without her I uh, wouldn't be able to achieve what I achieve so so yeah with that being said Life is looking up, and uh, I'm, I'm excited for my 90-day evaluation after my job to be over because then I get an automatic or guaranteed pay bump. So we'll definitely be able to afford our house just fine. Um, I, seeing my paycheck today at what I'm making currently and knowing what, it's, what the projected amount is going to be, it's just it's looking so good right now, and I'm, I'm so thrilled. So uh, I don't think I have any other things to talk about today but if we get up to any shenanigans today <laughs> Kaylee insisted I say shenanigans because I guess I say it in every video but uh, if we get up to any shenanigans today I will film them for you guys but then again I might not even include this if if we don't get up to shenanigans shenanigans I just like saying shenanigans Yep, that's about it. <laughs>